you're going to start hemodialysis next month because your kidneys aren't working properly. The dialysis machine will act like your kidneys to clean waste and excess fluid from your blood. How long will I need to have dialysis? You'll have to have dialysis until you can have a kidney transplant. Okay. I see. Before you have dialysis, you'll need to have an arteriovenous or AV fistula created in your arm. What's that? A fistula is an artificial connection between an artery and a vein. The fistula makes the blood vessel larger and stronger. It also makes it easier to connect your blood vessel to the dialysis machine. Right. That makes sense. When the fistula has healed, you'll be ready for dialysis. Two thin needles will be inserted into the fistula to slowly remove your blood, so it can be transferred to the dialysis machine. After the blood is cleaned in the dialysis machine, it is passed back into the body through the second needle. How often will I have dialysis? Each dialysis session takes around four hours to complete. We try to make you as comfortable as possible in the dialysis center. You can watch television, have a nap or listen to music. Is it painful? It's not painful, but dialysis can make you feel a bit sick. You may have some muscle cramps as well. Your fluid intake will be restricted while you're on dialysis, and you'll be on a special diet as well. What sort of diet? You'll have to reduce the amount of sodium in your diet and avoid foods that are high in potassium and phosphorus. The dietitian will speak to you about your diet during your first visit. Okay, thanks.